How to write a cover letter in 2023 step-by-step -step guide. So, you need to write a cover letter. Where do you start? How long should it be? Do yourself a favor. Follow our guide on making the best cover letter the recruiter has ever seen. What is the purpose of a cover letter? A good cover letter persuades the employer your qualifications match their needs, plus shows you did research and take the job seriously, proves you understand the challenges of the company, reflects that your vision aligns with their goals, presents how your skills and experience are a solution. Ultimately, a good cover letter should be all about why should we hire you and what's in it for us. The winning tactic here is focusing on them, not just on you, which will ultimately make you stand out from other applicants. And that's why it's worth spending time writing a solid cover letter. Let's find out how to do it. How to write a cover letter. To write a great cover letter, use a business letter style. Include your and the employer's contact details and address the hiring manager if you can. In 200 to 400 words, highlight your achievements, skills, and experience that make you the best fit for the job. 1. Start with a header. A professional cover letter opens with a header. Ideally, your cover letter header should be the same as in your Zoom for consistency, so feel free to use the same template. If you prefer to write the header of your cover letter from scratch, include the following contact information. Full name job title phone number mail address. 2. Address the reader. Once you're done with the header, it's time to mention the location and date of writing. Then, address your cover letter directly to the hiring manager like so. Dear Catherine, Dear Ms. Smith, Dear Mr. McConnor. According to studies, people respond actively to hearing, seeing their Nemeso use it in the cover letter salutation. Look for the hiring manager's name by checking the job description. Go into the company's LinkedIn page to look for the person responsible for uploading the job offer. If you can't find the name by any means possible, opt for Dear Hiring Manager. Avoid starting your cover letter with to whom it may concern like the plague. And if you're not living in Victorian England, don't start a cover letter with Dear Sir or Madam either. 3. Make a proper introduction. Here's the brutal truth. These few sentences at the beginning of your cover letter will determine whether the hiring manager will read on. So you need to start your cover letter in a way that attracts and holds the reader's interest. Here are several proven strategies for starting your cover letter. Highlight your achievements. Display your passion and enthusiasm. Drop names. Do all the above. 4. Explain why you're the perfect fit. The second paragraph main body of your cover letter has a couple of jobs to perform. 1. Give the hiring manager what they're looking for. 2. Show that you'll satisfy the company's specific needs. Let's look at the cover letter example from above to see how this could be done. Remember Jane, our digital marketing manager candidate. The XYZ company she applies to needs based on the job ad. A savvy digital marketing manager one. Someone who will supervise the development of their new online portal too. In the first sentence, prove you're an expert in your field refrain from bragging too much. The remaining part should be all about how your previous experiences will help your future employer press ahead with their plans. 5. Show your motivation to join the company. Your future employers have needs. If they're willing to hire you, it's because they think you'll satisfy those needs but they also want you to enjoy working with them. That way, they know you're more likely to stay with them for longer. The key to writing a perfect third paragraph of your cover letter is showing the hiring manager why you want this job, not just any job. That's particularly important for entry-level candidates and through some ambition, help prove you'll hit the ground running. 6. Close with a promise. How to make the best cover letter ending. By providing value, the worst mistakes you can make in writing the final paragraph of your cover letter are coming off needy, focusing on how much you want the job, not on what you have to offer, repeating the cliche phrase, thank you for your consideration and your time, 
Instead, tell the hiring manager that you're looking forward to meeting in person and discussing how your experience and knowledge can help your future employer fulfill their goals. 7. Stay formal in the closing salutation. Once you've written the body of your cover letter, you just need to put a formal closing at the very end. Write sincerely and follow it with your full name. Adding your handwritten signature is optional recommended for more formal cover letters. If you're not a fan of the well-worn sincerely, feel free to use any of the following. Thank you, best regards, kind regards, respectfully yours, with best regards. 8. Add a postscript. All of the above sections are must-haves in a good cover letter, but there's one special trick you can use with postscript. Why is it so important? Because it's like a magnet for the hiring manager's eyes that screams, you cannot miss this information. Use the postscript when creating a cover letter to tell the hiring manager about something impressive about your career, even if it's not strictly related to the job opening, and say you'd be happy to provide them with more details if they find it interesting. 9. Double check the formatting. So, you're done writing the cover letter. Now all you have to do is send it, right? Hold up. Before you hit send, make sure your cover letter formatting is intact. Here's everything you need to know about how to format your cover letter. Choose a legible cover letter font like Ariel or Garamond and keep it between 10 and 12 points in font size. Set even margins on all sides. One inch margins should be perfect. Left align all your contents. Use double cover letter spacing between paragraphs and 11.15 between lines. Title your cover letter by job title cover literary. Let your cover letter layout stay intact and root to the recruiter by saving the file in PDF. Plus, a great cover letter that matches your resume will give you an advantage over other candidates. Key takeaway. For the final thought on how to write a great cover letter in eight steps. 1. Ensure your contact info in the header is correct. 2. Address your hiring manager or recruiter personally. 3. Attract their attention in the introduction. 4. Use your experience to prove you're the exact match to the company's needs. 5. Explain your motivation and fit for the position. 6. Finish with a call to action and ask for a meeting. 7. Be formal in the closing sentiment. 8. Include a postscript.